In Brussels, talks on gas transit from Russia to Europe via the Ukrainian gas transmission system are being held today. Representatives from Ukraine, Russia and the European Union will discuss the terms of the new gas transit deal. The current 10-year agreement expires at the end of 2019. Our correspondent Yulia Krychkova is in Brussels right now. Hello Yulia, could you please update us on the latest? Hello, Tonya. As of now, now, bilateral meetings are still taking place. Vice President of the EU Energy Union, Maro Shevchovich, met with the Russian delegation. He separately discussed the details with representatives of Ukraine. The talks were mainly about the unbundling, uh, as it is one of the main requirements of Ukraine to successfully sign the contract. Ukraine should transfer their responsibilities of gas transportation from Naftogaz to a different company by the end of the year. Uh, in about uh, half an hour, trilateral uh, uh, consultations bec between Ukraine, Russia and uh, the European Union will begin. Uh, today, all sides are supposed to reach an agreement on the duration uh, of the contract, the volume of uh, transit uh, through the Ukrainian GTS and the price of this service. Ukraine is seeking to secure transportation volume at uh, 60 billion cubic meters per year. We will stay here and update uh, the further on the results of the uh, negotiation. Uh, neg neg uh, back to you, Tonya. Thank you so much, Yulia. That was our correspondent Yulia Krychkova reporting live from Brussels, where trilateral gas negotiations between Ukraine and the EU and Russia are taking place.